morning. Thank you for joining us. You're watching the news from Bahrain Television. The Royal Endurance Team, led by His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa, continued a series of great achievements in Europe after the victory in the French Normandy Province Championship in Arzentin area. Wider Ghazi Al Dosiri won the first place in the 125 km race, and Wider Mohammed Al Khatari won the first place in the 90 km race. His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa was forced to withdraw from the race after the injury that he suffered in the third stage. His Highness expressed a deep pleasure of the results of the Royal Endurance Team. His Highness said the injury that he sustained is not dangerous and that he suffered after falling from the horse in one of the turns which led to his release from the race after the injury of the horse. The first deputy chairman of the Supreme Council for Youth and Sports and the president of Bahrain Athletics Association, His Highness Sheikh Khalid bin Hamad Al Khalifa, congratulated national athletic team player Albert Rawab for breaking the Bahraini record for a 5,000-meter race, which was held in the Diamond League yesterday in Monaco. Bahrain secured the second place in the race, where it witnessed strong competition and with the participation of players from various international teams. Rawab won the silver medal where 15 players from different parts of the world participated in. His Highness Sheikh Khalid affirmed that what has been achieved in Monaco is a source of pride for the Bahrain athletic game and its reputable position internationally. He said that such accomplishment is also attributed to the efforts exerted by the Federation Board of Directors and their sane decisions in choosing competitive programs and participation of players of the national team which contributes in elevating their standard. He added that Albert Robb is an important player within the national team and has a promising future, wishing him and all other players of the national team every success in their future participation. The Speaker of the Representatives Council, Khalifa bin Ahmad al Dahrani, received today the Minister of the Interior, Lieutenant General Sheikh Rashid bin Abdullah al Khalifa, in the presence of the Minister of State for Interior Affairs, Major General Adil bin Khalifa al Fadl, and heads of parliamentary blocks and members of the Foreign Affairs, Defense, and National Security Committees at the Council. The Minister of the Interior updated the MPs on security development in the aftermath of the terror bombing, which targeted Sheikh Isa bin Salman Mosque in West Rafah last Wednesday night as worshippers were performing the Taraweeh prayers. He said that the ministry will dissipate doubts and reveal all the circumstances surrounding the terror bombing. The minister paid tribute to His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa for his directives to protect Bahrain and maintain national security and stability. He vowed to enforce a rule of law on parties which flout the law, incite on violence, sabotage and terror, aid saboteurs and terrorists. He stressed the necessity of beefing up security measures to counter the spate of terror attacks and fall the designs of terrorists and instigators who are adamant on destabilizing Bahrain and superviting national security. He also affirmed the cooperation with international security agencies in Bahrain and other friendly countries in the region to have more edge in confronting mounting threats and challenges. Lieutenant General Sheikh Rashid stressed the importance of differentiating between the legitimate freedom of expression and the incitement on terror and violence. He commended loyal citizens for their stances in supporting the security forces, stressing the importance of cementing national unity and fostering patriotic responsibility to protect Bahrain. The Minister of the Interior commended the role of MPs as partners in assuming national responsibilities to achieve security and stability, calling for tougher legislation to deter the proponents of violence and terror. The Speaker and MPs stressed the need to impart the feeling of security among citizens and residents and confront all that threatens civil peace. They commended the efforts of the Ministry of Interior to maintain stability and enforce the rule of law, paying tribute to the security forces for their dedication in protecting people. They pledged to step up cooperation between the Parliament and the Ministry of Interior, stressing the importance of upgrading legislations to better deal with the upcoming period and bolster national security and stability. 
sons of the Deputy Premier Sheikh Ali bin Khalifa Al Khalifa, Sheikh Khalifa and Sheikh Isa bin Ali Al Khalifa, honored today a number of voluntary work pioneers and outstanding school students from Harra Governorate. The honoring came as part of their recognition to those who serve the society and their keen desire to encourage those who seek excellence and innovation. Sheikh Khalifa and Sheikh Isa expressed pride in honoring personnel from Harra Governorate and voiced support for innovation and excellence. They affirmed that support societal work is a path or step which was taken by His Royal Highness the Prime Minister who has always supported voluntary and social work as well as recognizing outstanding students. They voiced pride in following the same path and concluded by saying that their presence is a message of appreciation and recognition for anyone who dedicates time and effort to be outstanding and works toward building his country and contributes in its development and prosperity. Thank you.